What was the best advice ever given to you, Jack? I remember right before I was going to run for Congress in 2002, okay. and this was before Governor Patton had you know, imploded in that scandal I referred to. He was still relatively popular, and I'd been working for him, okay. and everyone expected he would endorse me right off the bat. And I was making the case that, look, I'd helped draft the higher ed reforms. I'd worked on major right. legislation. I was, I was a key aide uh, during his administration, and everyone just expected it. And uh, I sat down with him before I announced, this was in the summer of 2001, and just face-to-face mm -hmm. -face in a hotel room when he had a little spare time, and we had about a 45-minute conversation. Okay. And I wanted his endorsement, and he withheld it at that point. Okay. And said to me, you know, Jack, he said, I'll never forget this. He said, you go out there and get a bunch of the Indians, and you watch the chief follow. And he was telling me to go out and line up some key endorsements, show that I had some momentum behind Wow. my campaign, okay, and that he I would come you. along at the opportune time. I got you. And I left that meeting a little angry, mm -hmm. a little hurt, because I'd worked for him for six years. But in retrospect, it was a great piece of advice, especially for politics. Because right. what he was telling me was, go out there and stand on your own two feet, young man. This mm -hmm. isn't going to work if I throw you out there. You're going to have to make the case yourself for your candidacy. You're going to have to build the relationships with the interest groups of the community mm -hmm. that will make your candidacy viable. You're going to have to go out there and work it. And then once you've done that, I'll come along and help as I can. And as a result of that piece of advice, I worked even harder. And even after that race, I had some political standing in the community. Okay. I had relationships with key constituent groups throughout Louisville and Jefferson County. And I was a much stronger political figure for having done it that way than for having done it the way I wanted it initially. So it was a wonderful piece of advice that he gave me. That is great advice. Yeah.